Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to EU4 as Portugal, otherwise known as Murder Everyone Around You Simulator 2019. Uh, speaking of which, though, I think we've actually been paying a little bit less attention to Aragon uh, than we should be, and a little bit more to, to uh, Telemkin, which isn't really an issue since we're going to be declaring war on Telemkin pretty damn soon, just taking a whole bunch of their stuff, but I think Aragon could use a little bit more love in a few years, rather than just like a year in like a couple months. Uh, but yeah, we're definitely going to have to keep cutting Aragon down. Uh, to their, you know, rightful size here. It might just take Navarre just for, like, for the, for the symbolism where they just get to keep all this stuff and I guess they get to take a lot of Italy, I don't know. I'm um, also decided that, yes, the music is, is allowed to be a little bit more, I don't know, present now. I decided it just wasn't present enough, so. There you go, we get, we get a little bit more music in the background, everything's feeling a little bit more nice. Uh, it's gonna take absolute ages for these horses to be done, but it's fine because we're gonna need the manpower to build up anyway. So we're just gonna burn someone? Uh... Alright, so I might have to burn. Wow, that kind of sucks, because I'm going to have to replace that stability. Just like that. And, if you haven't noticed, my religious unity is not the greatest that it could be, so... Yeah, hopefully we can get that done a little bit better. Uh, we do want religious ideas. Oh yeah, lots of things that we have to get done soon. In the very, very uh, near future, we're going to have to take this tech. Or in like a year, we're going to take that tech. Uh, we can ask for contribution, which seems like the best thing to do right now. It's a hell of a lot of money, so we're going to be taking it, obviously. Uh, we can do trade company investments, which wouldn't be the worst thing in the world, although it's just like the fact that we don't have either of these things, and everything over here kind of sucks a bit, we just took it because, I don't know, kind of influence. Um, the best thing to do with our money right now, though, would definitely be to upgrade some of our, our trade nodes here. Now, we also, we already have a ton and ton of money in uh, Sevilla, so I'm wondering if maybe we should upgrade this one, just to get us a little bit more in, uh, in Tunis. There's also Toledo, and all these things up here need to be improved as well, okay. We're, we're going to take a look at stuff up here, actually. So what's up here? We have a... Uh, what's the best trade power here? We're going to look at all of them. 6.8, 6.1, 6.9, 6 which is definitely very, very good. 24.1, very, very nice as well. Okay, we're going to go with this one definitely first. And this one down here. Uh, wait, compare these two. 20.9, 24.1, okay. Yeah, much better. We're going to go with maybe a little bit more... Somewhere, not over here. This area kind of sucks, not gonna lie. Like, it's good in terms, in terms of development, but trade power, it's actually just not as good as you would imagine it would be, so. I think uh, Tangier is probably gonna be the, the best option to start with. There you go, spent literally just 300, uh, sorry, 600 ducats right there on stuff that's, to be honest, probably not gonna be super useful, but oh well. Uh, you guys can lose, oh wow, either of you losing wealth kind of sucks, doesn't it? But we don't want the, the burgers to be too powerful. So, they're going to be a little bit upset for a while, which is fine. Uh, that also allows me to turn it down in my ears if we technically turn up on the uh, the console or whatever thing I use. Alright, so everyone here? No, we have a couple of cannons to be done here. Oh, they finally did it. The Mad Lads finally got rid of Albania after they migrated. I don't even know how Albania moved here, and uh, I'm still probably never going to find out. Actually, I do want to find out. Okay, okay, my Venice. Okay, so this is owned by Venice. Occupied by Hungary, then Austria, then Venice, then Austria. Doesn't even tell me when it was annexed. Well, I guess it was occupied by... by Austria. Stop being a core of Venice. Liberated from... Okay, so like it was... Annexed by Albania. Then... So Albania just got like a free core or something like there? And just sort of like stuck? I have no idea. But wow, that's weird. That's really, really odd. Who knows the weird inner workings of this odd, odd game. But uh, yeah, just as I say that, there goes Albania. Or whatever's you know, left of it. They didn't even have like Albanian culture, did they? Well, they did. Oh, that's kind of odd. So these areas had Albanian culture. Okay. Well, I understand this one because they actually have a core on this. Or you have like a reconquest from the beginning of the game. I tried Albania like once. It didn't didn't go well, but I tried it. You know, uh, Tunisian separatists. You guys, you guys can probably take care of yourself, but just in case you can't, which I'm assuming you can't. Oh right, yeah, that's that's a big problem. That's a massive issue. Oh yikes. Oh yikes. That isn't that's an actual problem. That is literally an issue. Okay. What am I losing all my money to? I would like to know. Uh, advisors, state maintenance, subsidies. Who am I subsidizing? Oh yeah, my colony, goddamn. Because you're supposed to be colonizing things, so you better be doing your goddamn job. Uh, one, two, three, four. Five, so, okay, yes you are. Okay, good. So at least you're doing that. 
I don't agree with the fact that you that you're not my religion, but you know I can probably overlook it for now. And at some point I'll probably like tell you to change it, but it doesn't matter right now. Yeah, so as long as you guys like me, you're sending me money. Uh, tariffs aren't even that much, honestly. Like it's just thirteen percent, so it's fine. Uh, Marcus giving me a lot of money too, which is nice. So I don't think I need to subsidize you anymore, do you? Do I? Because you're making your own fair sum, aren't you? Right. 3.34. Expenses are colonies. Income is two ducats of subsidies. So you can still survive. Technically. I could probably get rid of the subsidies, I'm just saying. Because they are, they are a little bit pricey as of right now. Uh, any other problem? I mean, army maintenance? Yeah. Because we're up at full. Just to get rid of these guys. Okay. I'm going to have to uh, drop these guys a little bit, actually. And by a little bit, I mean a lot. A lot of it, you know. Oh, nice. Okay. Uh, the reason for that is because these guys are probably going to end up popping, right? Apologies for my voice sounding super de dehydrated because I'm a little bit uh, <clears throat> late in the night. So, Tunisian Separatists. You guys, I'm going to keep a close eye on you. And hopefully this time I can actually, like, do it right. 80%. I'm watching you guys. I'm watching you. If you get to 90%, we're hitting that button so fast, it's not even funny. Also, can we get the new tech? Yes, we can. Oh my god. Okay. Completely forgot about that. Okay, yeah, let's get the, uh... New infantries. The Tercio or the, uh, free shooters? The morale's kind of even. Just depends on where you want to put it. Offensive or defensive. I do like the defensive positioning more. Well... Let's go with the free shooters, actually. I think they'll be a little bit more useful. Because they more, they're more offensive oriented, right? So we're gonna try and catch people on the uh, on the offensive. So you guys are just a Commonwealth and Savoy. I don't know how you guys have managed to get yourselves back in in good favor with the Commonwealth, but uh, yeah, it's not good that you did. Most certainly, is not not good that you did. I cure you. Okay. Actually, let's do uh, let's do ourselves like a favor and check real quick. Commonwealth <laughs> didn't even have to type in. Okay, that's an issue in of itself. Quite the, quite the large issue, actually. Uh, nothing that can be really done better right now. Do we have any more people to give you? Wait, hold on. Uh, 10 for 8. 12 for 8, okay. Whoa. Click the button. Why don't you add to this? Don't, don't play tricks on me. Like this, okay? Paradox, I don't like this. You join you joined the army, but But I don't trust that you actually did. Didn't say that you were supposed to join the army. Or this this group up army little thing. Eh, eh, bip, bip. I saw that. Tunis. Haha, -ha, no. Hmm. Told you I was gonna crack down on it this time. Okay. I would be really disappointed if I failed it like again, so. Uh, where are my where are my pirate hunting lads? Okay, over here? Cool. We're going to tell you if you don't have to upgrade or anything, right? Okay, cool. Do you have to upgrade? No. Do you have to upgrade? No. Okay, cool. So we're going to send you over there. We're going to group everyone up here. Because we're going to be fighting people who have, like, actual coasts and perhaps maybe ships. So we're going to check, like, uh... Tlemcen, apparently, is actually correct pronunciation, if, as, as I have been told. I just called it Tlemcen because for the long amount of time I just watched other people call it Tlemcen. So, I don't know. Tlemcen, if that's, if that's the right way to pronounce it. I will definitely pronounce it that way, but uh, yeah, we're looking for navies. 27. God damn. That is impressive, to say the least. And, oh, Inland Sea. Yikes. Okay. Uh, should we probably lead them out into the strait? Probably, yeah. Let's uh, let's take a look at Triple E as well. Can I type? Okay. Nice. Cool. Okay, so combined, they definitely have a lot more ships. Galleys are kind of the thing that they like here. I'm going to start building my own galley fleet eventually. Uh, as of right now, I'm not really involved in the Mediterranean, except for, you know, obviously, immediately right now. Uh, yeah, just, just disregard all of that. Because I'm gonna, I'll build like a fleet of galleys at some point, like 20 of them. They should be probably fine. Uh, let's give you guys a leader as well, actually. How many leaders do we have? One out of three. Okay, so we need an admiral. We need a general. Can I get those for free? No, not even slightly. Cool. 
So, uh, General, I hope to God that you're not absolutely terrible. Hey, you're actually not that bad. You don't know how to siege or, uh, or fire a musket for, you know, life of you, but at least you can, at least you can, like, ride down on horses and, like, run around and stuff. I don't know. He's literally just a horse, I suppose. Uh, that's cool, I guess. And as for our little, uh, little armada here, which I wouldn't really call an armada, or, or, and, uh, yep, yeah, yeah, you know, I wouldn't call an armada in, like, literally any way, shape, or form, but, you know. Uh, let's just get explorer or an admiral. Ooh, that's the question. That is the question of the hour. 4 and 11 pips, 5 and 13 pips. So the admiral just has the higher chance of being good. Explorer could be useful because we don't have to spend more points. But we're, we're, we're in a fighting mood, you know? And at least he can... I, he can't do much, but you know at least he's, he's, he exists, right? So that's that's the real bonus there. Mm. Yeah, okay. So we're going to start this war. We're going to sort of do this thing. We're going to do this thing. We're going to wait until the first of whatever months after September, which I'm pretty sure is November. Oh, god damn, really? You couldn't let me chill for one second. Corruption and ducat loss. Wow, that is that is that is a spicy duo there. That is a fantastic. Wow. Well, rest in peace, uh, peacetime debt. Damn, that really sucks. Anyways, let's start the war. We can't declare war on you because the Ottomans are yeah, kind of thinking that would be a great idea for them. Um, did I not actually claim this? Oh no, I didn't because I wanted the spy network. Well, it's gonna decrease anyway, so I may as well like. Get the, get the claim. Uh, so let's go with Tatooine, I suppose. It sounds like a place from Star Wars. That's because it is. I watched a, a Star Wars film. Maybe. I wasn't really big into Star Wars, alright? Okay, so here you, I'm pretty sure that's I'm pretty sure that's a Star Wars thing, though. So anyway, uh, yeah, okay. Get rid of your autonomous rebel suppression. That wasn't actually as important. Okay. Uh, yeah, speed three. Yeah, 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 yeah. Cool, cool. We're going to start off our good old little, I don't know, walk-in party here. Is that minus 20 ducats? Whoa. Mm-hmm. Corruption. Oh, mm. Corruption. Mm -hmm. Right. Goddamn. That's... That is money. Mm-hmm. <laughs> that's a lot of money. Okay. Let's uh, check out our numbers here. Okay, um, ba -ba 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 -boo. Facing, a f a pep. facing a total of like 40,000 troops, which means over here should be basically what we uh, in the business like to refer to as a breeze. Um, yeah, this should be, this should be like a walk in the park on this front. This front though, ah, that's going to be a bit of a different, a different story here. Right, so we're going to split these guys in half. I only want to keep so many guys there because the attrition is like literally disgusting. Desert warfare, ugh, literally disgusting. Uh, so hopefully you guys can group up together. We've got four cannons on here. Four cannons on a fort that is like literally just worth one. Hopefully it's good enough. Uh, you can chill here actually because I don't think there's anyone there. If there is, well, <laughs> goddamn, kill me. I don't know. Uh, Morocco, you guys, what did I tell you guys to do? Actually, supportive. Okay, can you go on the. Uh, Aggressive, actually. All right, nice. Thank you very much. You guys can be done. Just gonna occupy the entire country first. I don't. I'm not sure they actually have a navy or not a navy, a uh, an army anymore. I think we killed it. Also, we do holy war. Oh yes, thank you very much. Oh, we really need that manpower. Holy war is fantastic. I think it's like 15 percent. Am I wrong? Yeah, 15 percent. Papal sanctions of war. Nice. Alrighty then. Really using those uh. Those benefits that are like not not really that good to uh to our, our benefit, yeah. That that's a thing. Yeah, okay. We're gonna send you guys over here just so we can like make sure these guys don't literally die, even though they really shouldn't, but just in case. Uh we're gonna oh, can I group? Can I Am I hitting the wrong key? Oh, we need to wait a day. Right, forgot about that. One really odd feature that shouldn't exist. Let's bring you guys back over there. Should be fine. Uh, boo, 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 boo. you over there. Spicy. Alrighty then. Am I missing anything over here? I, I would say yes, I definitely missed something over here. I would say more than just something that I missed here. I, I'd say I missed quite a lot of things here, actually. 
Yeah, supportive, support, support. Yikes, yikes, yikes. They're gonna go straight for, for Fez. Oh, yikes. Please, please siege Fez. Please get this. Is it worth it? I, I want to say it's so worth it, but it's, it's not. But it is. But it's not. If we take the fort, then we're in such a good position. But if we don't take the fort, we're in a really, really bad position. So, 225 points. Okay, let's let's contemplate our options here. Yeah, nothing here is important. We don't have any ideas required. This we're gonna we're gonna do it because I just really want this to hopefully get killed. Honestly, okay. Well, I, that's what we call uh, that's terrible. Yeah, that really sucks. Honestly, um, you guys better stop. Honestly. We're converting you, but it won't take very long, okay? The process is basically painless and it's almost over, okay? I wouldn't call it painless, but it's, it's almost over at the very least, if, if literally, literally nothing else. Uh, you guys should be helping out here, actually, because you're not doing anything, so you might as well just, like, chill. Uh, I want to know where they think they'll be doing anything over here. I want to, like, check out their navies, you know? What are the navies actually doing? Can I, like, kill them or anything? Uh, you guys like me, Orkandian Diplo? I mean, to be fair... PowerPoints are PowerPoints, if I'm going to be honest with you. So. You guys are going to go there. You guys are going to go. Wait one day. Wait, 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 wait. There you go. Wait one day and go over there. Hopefully you guys get this done. Nope. Okay. Totally fine. Because we're going to be moving the ships over. So we can get uh, started on Kath, I think is how that's pronounced, maybe. Oh, that's a lot of guys. That's a lot of guys. A lot of guys I don't want to fight. Oh my god, so many guys. Uh, See, Triple E is over at the very least. If, if nothing else is going on here, except for a minus one versus a nine. Huh, thank you, game. That's exactly what I needed. How did you know? Oh my god. We got better morale, but we got the higher tactics. But it doesn't matter when you're rolling like a literally negative number to a nine. To a nine. Yikes. That's a, that's a, ooh, that's a fat rip. Okay, we're gonna... Rest in peace that siege, rest in peace the military points. Maybe I should have pulled out earlier instead of just like pretending nothing bad was gonna happen. Probably. We are accumulating a little bit of debt, although Triple E has basically fallen. I don't know why I didn't take this. You guys go chill there. Okay. Uh this can only work if we get both of our forces going on at the same time, so we might just like chill. Kinda like right there. Ish. For now. Free advisor, yeah, we're definitely gonna need something like. I mean, force speed doesn't matter when we don't have enough men to reinforce. For defense, though, hey, that's the spicy one, so. Uh, yeah, especially when it's up here. Oh, that's nice. That's good. Okay. We really needed that, honestly. Uh, so we can get, you know, enough people to fight. You know what we could use? We could use some Go Westward, honestly. Mile of Navy, yeah. Yeah, we're gonna need that if we're gonna be fighting galleys in here. We should be able to win this. Although we won't be able to siege it for like three days, or not three days, but oh my god, you gotta, are you kidding me? Are you literally kidding me? Do I have to send like one more guy over there? Like honestly, do I do I have to do this? And send one guy like here, or, like there, or something, somewhere? Okay, you guys gotta chill together, actually do this, uh, and then... What are you missing right now? Please not calf, oh, definitely calf, okay, cool. Totally didn't say, please not have or anything. Uh, religious ideas, not important right now. We don't have enough money to convert anything. Uh, that's being a bit of an issue. Okay, uh, so basically, this is gonna work. Is we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna something. I'll I'll think of something. Probably. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna we're gonna cross the strait actually. And the reason for that is because we're gonna They don't have a general right there. I'm pretty sure it would take multiple days for them to reach even there. Also, it's kind of the hills, or it's the highlands at the very least, with here. We're also gonna say, uh yeah, allow you guys to attach. Thank you very much. We're gonna go and crush these guys. Hopefully. I mean, we're just we're just assuming that's very much possible. If they're Significantly fewer men, no general, and they're on a fort that's disadvantageous. That's not a word, is it? Maybe. Uh, not very advantageous to them. Okay. Maybe we can. Uh, maybe we can get that done now. All right. So you know, Morocco, we're gonna be. We're gonna change you guys up. You're actually gonna be 
Uh, defending your own land, which means siege that stuff back down, especially mine as well. Uh, yeah. Now remember how well the last time this worked out. Uh, worked out splitting a guy off. Um, so we're gonna we're gonna hope it works again, or you know at all. Also got to bring this guy over. This is just this is an absolute mess on the uh, the eastern front here. I feel like I'm playing as, as, as Germany and Hoy, except real life, because of how terribly my eastern front's going. Uh. It's really because we don't have any people. That's kind of an issue, you know? Uh, so we're going to have to send this guy over for like 10 seconds, and then he can come back with the, with the other 900 guys here. Okay. You guys are good? Nice. Okay. Uh, so, I realize you like sieging down your, your own stuff first, Morocco, because, you know, that would be a, that's cool and stuff. But once, once you're done that, could you please siege down my stuff? That would be great. Thank you very much. We got a plus three on this thing. Are you are you kidding me? We got a plus three and it's already at, still at minus fourteen. I suppose it could be like minus forty nine for the beginning, which would suck even more. So okay, cool. I'm a little wary of this stack there. I'm actually a little bit wary wary of all these stacks. I'm afraid I'm afraid these guys kind of that kind of like left out here to be stranded. Uh, they're gonna get killed if I don't pay a lot of really really uh, attentive attention attention. Yes, that one. 25 admin or local. Oh, wait, Sfax, where are you? Wait, no, no, this one. Sfax. Literally right there under my nose. I couldn't be bothered to look at it. Okay. Your unrest is already kind of garbage. Don't want more unrest. Don't want monthly autonomy change. I want the autonomy to go down. So we're going to be losing admin, I guess, which sucks a lot. Uh, time for another good old loan? Oh, you betcha. Ooh, you betcha there, bud. It's gonna be a whole lot of fun. On the bright side, though, we have, like, the world's strongest uh, supply network, although it doesn't matter, because you've got local fortifications, defensive mentality, and mountains. But okay, that's cool. Speaking of which, rest in peace these guys, because that is a 444 versus a 331, and we can't get out of here, so I guess we're just gonna die here. Oh! Wait, yes we are. We are gonna die here, actually. But if literally nothing else, uh, we're, we're doing some good stuff against against Tripoli. Speaking of which, we're definitely gonna split this guy in half. Send these guys over there, and tell them to just murder them. Although we lost that battle, we weren't stack wiped, which is good. You know what's even better? We can replace everyone with mercs. That's not better, actually. That's just, like, fixing your own problems. Uh, speaking of problems, Tun Tunis. Good thing I caught you guys on the 90%. Also be kicking myself. Um... Oh, and it looks like Tripoli is having a lot of rebel issues, which also means issues for me. Because I don't want to fight all of them, and they're walking away to siege... This is this is literally terrible. How is this allowed as a thing? They're using... They're, they're using guys to, to blockade? Is that is that what's going on here? I can't even be sure. I can't even be certain if they're just using rebels to blockade themselves. Because it, it would actually work, maybe. Who knows? Who even knows? I don't, that's for certain. Check the uh, deaths on each side. I'm sure I have a whole bunch more. Oh yeah, look at that attrition. Delicious. Okay. Move you guys over there. Uh, where are our ships actually? Where do we put them? They're right here. Okay, cool. You know what they're gonna be? They're gonna be over here now. Hopefully we can put enough pressure. Oh yeah, we put enough pressure for them to leave actually. Uh, speaking of pressure on leaving, hopefully we can catch them. Ooh. Oh, that's spicy. That's. Ah. You'll love to see that, okay. It also took two two galleys, so we literally just like traded a little bit, which is nice. Totally fine with me. Uh, I just hope like Tlemkin is, is willing to, you know, hop out of this war real quick, although we only have 13% war score against him. Which, uh, in theory, is enough to like, to tell him to, to leave, but in practice, well, we're not really sure about that. We're gonna take out like, two more mercs, you know, just, just like keep him, keep him afloat here. Well, to get everyone in position enough to to attack that fort that keeps on being assaulted for you know the millionth times like every other fort here so we're probably not going to end up taking fez do i care about fez that much i actually do because i want to give morocco land but sometimes you know it just doesn't it just doesn't turn out the way you like it so sometimes it just doesn't turn out the way you wished it could that's actually stack wipe wasn't it hold on let's check the number of men here 16,000 3,000 3,000 They were undefined. If they're if they're undivided, they can take me down on Fez for like the third time or like the fourth. Time. I don't even know what time we are on this fort, but uh, 
in theory, see their 18k there. You know what we're gonna do? We're actually gonna go and shut them down before they, before they hit us on the fort. That's what we're gonna attempt to do. They stack up Morocco, which sucks, honestly. Oh, that's a fort there, buddy. Ooh, that was a mistake. Ooh, that was a big mistake. Yeah, yeah, get out of here. Also, I'm gonna go for you too. Uh, RPG subs. However much I would love the armed professionalism, and everyone to hate me more. Unfortunately, we're gonna have to go with this one, which means they like us more, which literally makes no difference to me. But you know, can we catch them here? Oh, hopefully we can catch more than just the one. Well, that sucks, but hey, at least we got a free one. Can we do anything here? Also, I heard that the big noises. Hold on, did I get the big noises? Because it's me. No, I didn't get the big noises. Okay, so I did get the big noises, but not the ones I wanted. You guys have literally no idea what I'm talking about, do you? Uh, it's like the one with the papal guys, like, elected. Like the Pope, that one. Yeah. Sunni Zealots. Ah, that's a bit of an issue, isn't it? I didn't, I didn't tell you to convert, did I, Morocco? I don't think so. Uh, I probably will at some point, but just like, not right now. Uh, why do you guys have so many people? Why don't you hire so many mercs? Yeah, that's a lot more people than there were before. Why don't you hire so many goddamn mercs? Okay, we're gonna we're gonna go in here actually, because I know you're not gonna you're not gonna stock uh, yeah you're not gonna stack all your of your men on one fort, and it's it's a good fort to defend from. Uh, that's ridiculous. That's ten years of 30, 30 go global settler increase. Uh, we're gonna win this, right? We're gonna win this, right? We're gonna win this, right? Ah, okay, there we go. Just gotta will it to happen, and sometimes it does. That's totally how it works. Quote, like, literally, you can quote me on that one. Because I, I can tell you, for, for certain, 100% guarantee. That's that's definitely how it works. Okay. So you guys, uh, all I really want is for you to stop being friends with the Ottomans, and perhaps return, like, a couple of cores, like... These ones? Or actually, no, not that one. Like... Can I... Tafalalti would be a big yes. Gold mine. Uh, Fez would also be a big yes. Maybe just like connect it all up with uh, it's not really connected, but you know what? Just make it look like beefier. Actually, no. <clears throat> we're gonna do this, and then we're gonna take as much land as we can, or not land uh, money from you. Cause goddamn, uh, do we have literally none of that? So hopefully that all works out just fine. Seems we're finally able to like. Start something over here. Oh, is that a free? Is that a free stack? It is, but I wouldn't. I wouldn't really risk it. Like we can see them down here, though, for now. So while we can, I suggest it'd be a good idea to just, like you know, keep it chill down here. Uh, I, I can't really tell if they're if they're coming for these guys or not. These guys suck. Okay. Pause for a second, uh, and Garb, which I believe, is that a good one or no? Garb? Is that a good one? Yes, it is a good one, okay. Protect our trade, of course. Of course, protect the trade. Oh. Oh, are you coming in on this? Are you gonna join in here with a little bit of fun? It actually beat me, though. That makes me a little bit worried. Ah, never mind. You're, you're definitely not gonna beat me. Makes us even better. Makes just just that much more spicy, right? Is that, uh... You're so scattered, I don't even know how you're going to be able to, like, survive existing for very much longer. Uh, we're definitely not going with that one. We really don't want to go with that one, because now, I literally, I think everyone's upset. Oh, yeah. I feel like the Louis the, what is that, like, a f 15th or something? Just upset, just literally upset, literally every estate, you know? Just make them all upset. Sure, sure, doesn't, doesn't even matter. Uh, Pernambuco. We could use the more instead of instead of kicking them out. Yeah, we're gonna do the the more thing, because that allows us to get it instantly, which is nice. Uh, what that also allows us to do is keep going a little bit further. Uh, wait, hold on. Did we did we take this? Oh, didn't even realize we took Rio de Janeiro. Okay, but we only had one colony in here, and that was this one. But nope. Right, let's go with uh, Bahia or Bahia. Seems almost better. Sure, let's just send in. We don't have enough money for anyone other than just like one guy, right? So we're gonna actually send. Minority, probably. A uh, Moroccan one, perhaps. Or Andalusian one. Yeah, I'll just kick him out of Sevilla. Sure, that's totally reasonable. Right? 100%. 100%. Just kick him out. Uh, so many separatists. Wow, okay. You, you guys are, like, crumbling your countries right now. 
And you're still saying no, honestly? Like, literally, you're gonna, you're gonna let this happen to your own country and just, like, sit there like, Yeah, it's fine! It's totally... I should have been paying attention. That is also not fine. Tunisian separatists, you guys literally, you gotta stop, okay? You just, you just gotta stop at some point. We can deal with you at some point. Because Castilian separatists are not the biggest issue, because you guys are more or less chill. Whoa, whoa, okay. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Rebels, quote unquote, successful. Shut up, it's fine. We have like nearly no men, so we really gotta get this, uh, kicked up a notch. I just love the, the sound of the walls crumbling, I don't know why. Does that make me weird? Maybe it does. You know, it probably does make me weird. It's just, it's, it's, it's like aesthetically pleasing to the ears, if that's, if that makes any sense. It's aesthetically pleasing. Ha. Ah, there you go, there's your, there's your, your daily pun. That's probably kind of fell out of use a long time ago. That kind of sucks. That makes my life a little bit harder, because then... Do I have Tatooine still? Well, I do. Okay. That makes everything worth it. And we have Fez, and can we take Tala Imsan? Beautiful. Okay. I believe you should be much more willing to accept literally anything I have to say. Uh, meaning... Yes, lots of money. Uh, oh yeah, do we want to, like, not... Have a good old truce with them for a long time? Hold on, where's the truce? 62. Can we get a truce that's less than 10 years, actually? I would, I would love to do that so much. 10 years on the dot. Hmm. Fifty-three is the earliest truce we can get. Five years. Okay. Tafelalt brings that up significantly. So if we take all your money, aligns uh, with the Ottomans and all that stuff. How long? How long is this truce? Fifty-eight. Yikes. Because when you get rid of someone's relations, it takes ten years for them to build back up. Right? It takes ten years before they're allowed to ally each other. Is what I mean. So our window, our window of opportunity here is extremely slim taking down Telemkin again. But I need the money. I need them to stop being friends with the Ottomans, first of all. And I want Tafelel. Now we have enough war score to do a whole lot more, but the better option is to not have to fight the Ottomans at all. But then there's also the Mali question. Where we'd only have to fight a couple of various tribes in, uh, in West Africa. But I'd much rather just fight Tlumkin. Well, we have to fight Mali and Tlumkin anyway, don't we? I think it's better to deal the damage to the Tlum to uh, uh sorry Tlumson. Hmm, yeah, okay, Tlumson. I think it's much better to deal the damage to Tlumson right now than than to wait. So let's take uh, so let's take what we can out of them. Let's actually not give uh, Marco Fez, because it just doesn't look nice. 